All right, so the challenge is the Cult of Isaac. Must take all followers in orbitals. Must reroll on non-follower non items at least once for picking up. You may pick up a boss room item if there is no charge available. Oh, that bum friend. He would be that, wouldn't he? That does count as a follower. But anything that follows me, I want. Doesn't mean I can't pick up other items. It just means I have to at least reroll them once. Now, if there's a way for me to get a charge on my D6, I have to reroll the boss item. But if there is no way for me to get a charge, I can still pick up the boss item. Hanged man, okay. Oh, see, the bum friend's not... He's not that bad. He's not that bad of a guy. He's not that bad of a guy. That's not a follower, so must we roll? That's orbitals. Bumfrey just wants to hang out, man, all right? What a relief. Thanks for being here, Wartho. Talker5, welcome to the Dapper Friend. Little hand to you. Little hand to you. Thanks so much. Mm -hmm. Twitch is so hype right now. GTA 5 and the LCS, my goodness. Twitch is so hype. <laughs> How long do you guys think the uh, GTA hype's gonna last? I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, I'm talking extreme hype here. I'm talking front page. I'm talking. It's gonna say a week. I think. I think GTA 5 has some lasting power on Twitch. I think it's gonna stay for a while after the week, but I think. Um, I think one week's it. Okay, I can't touch it because I can't reroll it. Battle of War does look pretty damn sexy. I'll say so myself. LCS is the um, League Championship Series for League of Legends. I'm gonna say no, I can't grab it to get out of the rotation. Must reroll before touching. I'm gonna say no on that. For added difficulty. World Championship League of Legends, sure. Is it actually the World Championship now? I don't follow League myself. I know that's a huge deal. Awesome. World Champion Series. That is a huge deal. Well, I'm incredibly thankful for how many people are watching me today. With all the hype. I gotta say, this is the best community I could have ever asked for, so thank you all for being so awesome. Oh. Should be able to get a charge for the D6. Should. Yeah, the World Champs is just its insane. What was there, almost a million people watching the finals last year? If I remember correctly. Do, 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 do. 200k right now. Yeah, there you go. That's fantastic. Uh, Esports has done a world of good for um, streaming in general. 
Um, but I'm gonna just go ahead and clear. I'll get my one reroll for the boss. I should have done the boss and then came back and cleared. Oh well. Actually, there could be an item in here, so maybe this was the right choice. What's in the box? Hell no. <laughs> Hell no. I don't know. It's it's hard as a broadcaster. Not so. It doesn't affect me so much, but it's hard as a broadcaster because the fluctuations in viewers uh, many times don't have anything to do with your broadcast or your game choice or anything. And stuff like uh, big games coming out or championship series and esports and all that. But it's all in good. It's all in good flow. <laughs> Good evening, Ned. How are you, sir? Absolutely, Nazarid. It brings a lot of people to the site that would never be here otherwise, too. So once all the hype dies down, um, there's new viewers for everybody. Big BDV. Welcome to the dam. Man, I have to re-roll this now, don't I? Well, shh. That hurts, man. That hurts. Oh, that was exceptionally cruel, and I'm not taking that item. I'm not taking it, because it's a bad interaction with lots of things. No, thank you, big BDB. Subscribing is the best way to support broadcasters, the best way to support my cast, anyways. The only guaranteed income you have as a broadcaster, so thank you for that choice. Then it shows up again. I have to re-roll that, too. Uh, Catanine has some bad interactions with other items, and, uh, it also, since I don't have any tears up or anything, it'll make it very hard to hit diagonal shots, so I'm gonna choose not to get it. What are the, can, what are the system requirements for Battlefield 4? I'm curious. I know my PC can handle it, but... I, I remember how taxing Battlefield 3 was when it first came out. It was nuts. Wow, graphics is 660. Wait, that that's recommended requirements? Damn. Oh, the recommended is high. Okay, the required isn't bad. Got it. Let's go re-roll this item. That's pretty intense. Oh, that, that, no net gain or loss. 20 gigs of hard drive space, man. That's cool, Big D. That's a, that's a good question for the chat. How many of you, how many of you join Twitch TV specifically to watch esports?
That's a big hit. That's a big hit, Soons. Thank goodness for the arcade. There we go. Thumbs up. Thumbs up if you join Twitch to watch esports. Thumbs down if you got here for other content. Come on, dude. Thank you. Okay, blood bag would be stellar here. I'm gonna say the blood bag is excluded from rolling. Viewer's choice on item pickups would be good. That'd be a good way to interact with the thumbs up, thumbs down. It is a fantastic promotional tool for developers. I 100% agree with that, Ned. 100% agree. Since it's a 50-50 is excluded, okay. I don't even know if I'm gonna get a chance to do so. Actually, I gotta use all my coins here, or as many as I can, because this gives me the chance at orbitals. If I get my third orbital, then I'm free to gamble where I want. Whoa. Nice pockets, yeah, man. It's been it's been quite the journey so far. I'm so happy with where the cast is at. So happy. Show me the money. Yeah, speaking of which, I need to I need to add in more giveaways to uh, my channel soon enough. I just been I need I'm working that into the format. It'll get there. <laughs> Cyrus Murf run a DX that run the run this program from your start menu or do the run prompt and then run that and it'll tell you what card you have. Get dunked, floaty head. I will try for a blood bag, but after I clear some and figure out how much health I have left on the floor, that's when I'll go for the blood bag. Uh, also hoping maybe to find some more money so I can do it easily contained inside of the... Uh, easily contained inside of the arcade itself. I'm not too worried about dodging stuff on uh, the caves. If I was in the depths, I'd probably try for the blood bag now, or eh, maybe not. I don't know, man. I had a lot of fun shooting stuff in Bioshock. I, I kind of got a little bloodlust there. Get off me. Oh, I do have the wafer, too. I forgot about that. The wafer is good. 
I'm gonna use my hangman here, even though I probably could have got money with it. Uh, I don't want to get hit in this room. I'll probably still play Splunky, Stiffalo. I just, uh, today is Team Meat Tuesday, so I play a game from Team Meat. I guess I'm past my required time, but I play for at least two hours Isaac or Meat Boy every Tuesday. And then, of course, Mugenics when it comes out as well. Okay, I think I'm gonna save another reroll to do that. Unless I can only reroll once. I should be able to reroll more than once. But well, the current schedule for right now is that I have Team Meat Tuesdays, which is Isaac or Meat Boy for at least two hours on Tuesdays. I have Indie Game Showcase Fridays. Every Friday I'm going to play an indie game that has never been seen before on the stream. Um, Saturday's Cooking with Frag when it's running. Sat uh, sorry, Cooking with Frag is going to start up next month. The first Saturday of next month is going to be the next episode. Moving into full formatting. Um, every Sunday is Subchoice Sunday. Which I need to get the uh, the poll sent out tomorrow. Where I give you guys a choice of three games, you pick the game, and I play it on Sunday. Right on, Steam. How was how was the world today? What's up, 12 wiener dogs? How are you, sir? Steam, please don't post spoilers in the chat. I'm sure some of you want to go back and watch those games without knowing the results. Yeah, I'll take that. Also, please don't start bashing teams and stuff in the chat. Keep it dapper. Support who you want to support. dropped any frames tonight, which I'm impressed with. I guess I should go fight the boss now. Maybe? Uh, let's go see if it's greed. Morning, Advent.
I don't have any followers. I wish I did. I'm about to have orbitals, though. So I basically have to, I have to reroll all items at least once. Oh wait, hold on a second. I can get uh I should reroll the second boss item because it's going to turn into a cube of meat, which is exactly the point of the challenge. So I need to go fight the boss before picking up this cube. In the spirit of the challenge. So many spawns, dude. Calm calm your pants. Calm it. Broski, calm down. Well, I should be able to get two cubes of meat on this floor. Gotta wait, gotta wait. Nice, stiff and low. Have a great one, sir. Enjoy your time off. Hey, Grotad, welcome back. Welcome to the Dapper. I would totally mini hand you, but there's a slight dodging problem. We'll get there. Welcome to the Dapper. Little hand to you. Thank you so much. Man, that hurts. Oh, it wasn't. Uh, maybe it's the first one. Ouch. Well, I guess I'll try to get a reroll on that again. I should have been Mr. Squee. I thought it was going to turn into a cube of meat. Uh, I've never been a fan of Grand Theft Auto Wiener Dog, so I have no interest in uh, in that. Good night, Home Slice. Right on, Ego Tad. I appreciate that. It's in fact true. Wait, I have to reroll all items at least once. Though there is no um, buying items is okay. Zaxxis is the maker of the challenge. Clears it. take that. Wish I would have taken Mr. Squeezy. I don't know how many followers I can get, really. I don't know how reasonable that is. I probably should have abused rerolls in the arcade, but uh... yes, I will have to reroll all boss items now. That's correct because I, I have available rerolls. I basically have to reroll every item.
Yep, I, I have the means to obtain charge after charge uh, for rerolls, so I'm kind of forced into doing so. Not yet. A blood bag would definitely make me feel a lot better about this run. My only damage up is the shiitake mushroom. I can't get Mr. Squeezy again, uh, since I didn't touch him. It's possible, but I think I'd have to roll through all the other rotations first. Just lowercase u, uh, or uppercase u, Rocket Ogre. Close. Okay, we'll go for the, uh, I'm gonna go for the, uh, Blood Bay. I got to. Uh, yes, there is new emotes. We did our first review section of formatting uh, today, so that's what it's used for. After I give my review, I'll just show you guys real quick everything that trickled over. After I do my review, or whatever it is, or whatever game it is, switch over to this screen, or this screen for now, and you guys get to cast your vote on what you thought of the game as well, because I only have one opinion, so that's your, your guys' way to give feedback. Hello, Luna. So Bioshock Infinite was my first review. I'll be doing a review of every single game that I play, on stream that is new, and then um, uploading that to YouTube as well, so they're all documented, so when you say, hey, Frag, what did you think of this game? Be like, hey, here's a video for you. With ratings and everything. Hello, Dr. Butt Touch. How are you today, sir? Bioshock got pretty good. Uh, it's, uh, I believe there's a highlight made by Raja already, and then I'm uploading to YouTube afterwards. Doing awesome, Dr. Butt Touch. Love saying your name, sir. At least one and a half hearts later in two. Because I think that's a bullshit review system, Sticks and Stones. That's how I feel. For me, what I want to hear out of a game review is not some off offhand rating like a 7.5 out of 10. I want to hear somebody's opinion and then hear somebody else's opinion on what the game is and then make an educated decision for myself. I hate putting arbitrary numbers on things. Like what does 7.5 out of 10 mean? Thank you, Bloodbag. Thank you. Yeah, number doesn't tell you what was wrong or right.
That sounds good, Cheeky Monkey. That's one way to do it. I'd better review a game. If I hate it, I punch myself in the balls for spending so much money on a game you hate. If I like it, I don't. I mean, that's a, that's a good honor system, really. 7.5 out of 10 tells me the company didn't pay for a review. Dirty little secret there. Awesome combat. These are the images I'm looking for. I've gotten several great submissions, including the review by, uh... Oh, God. Follow the Living. That's what I'm looking for. Any kind of graphic is good. Did... Okay, Gruber. Gruber got there. At least I got that speed up. This is still going to be a sketchy run, I can already tell. I can already tell it's going to be a sketchy. So sketchy. Well, sometimes other people's opinion is nice. I'm trying to keep, I want to keep all my reviews to like two minutes or less, including the chat, uh, the chat feedback portion. I shouldn't have touched that. We're just gonna let that one go. Necronomicon. Uh, yes, Dead Cat does count as a follower, indeed. I didn't think about that one. Oh god, what are you doing, sir? Okay, push this into him. Oh, I thought it was gonna be a quad. Thank you, Herba. Seems Groomer's a bit behind. I bet the chat servers are just wonky at the moment. Probably rightfully so. Yeah, we'll take that. Okay, the run rules is the Cult of Isaac must take all followers. If I am is not a follower, I must re-roll it at least once. They're doing a pretty crappy job of getting followers so far this run. Ha, uh, I don't think so, Kitsu. No Iron Chef for me, thanks. That was that was the most brutal challenge that ever happened between me and uh, Crumps 2. Only can only take food items, so you had to have the knife, shiitake mushroom, any mushroom in the knife was pretty much your limits. Uh, blood bags were available as well, but that was a gnarly challenge. Ooh, that took us a little over five hours to complete. Won it with just the shiitake mushroom, if I remember correctly. God bless America. Mm. Shiitake mushroom and a blood bag, I think is what got me there. Yeah, the bean was available too, and the black bean. Or was it the rebirth even out then? Or, sorry, Wrath of the Lamb. Meat. I'm trying to remember if that was pre or post uh, Wrath of the Lamb. I almost want to say it was pre Wrath of the Lamb we did that.
yeah, milk was available. Basically, all health items were available, but there was no damage or tears up, really. So... Thank you, Highlander. I think it'll be a helpful tool for everybody, which is the idea. I, can't, I, I was thinking, like, how many times do I get asked, what did you think of this game, Frag? Like, all the time. It was post Wrath of the Lamb, okay. That's right, it was just after Wrath of the Lamb released. My favorite item is Dr. Fetus, though I probably won't even take it if I find it anymore because it's just, it's so damn OP. Oh, no bombs left. Oh boy. Oh boy. Frickin' super greed, though. Super, super greed. It's gonna be a long fight. Help me, Orbitals. Help me, Tom Cruise. My Orbitals are so saving my ass right now. Yeah, keep spitting at me. That's all I want. Keep spitting. No, not that. Keep spitting. Okay, my damage is atrocious right now. Uh, there's definitely a chance I can pull this out, but man. If I had not re-rolled Mr. Squeezy, I'd be feeling a lot better. One bomb left, I guess. Yeah, no hitter by luck. That was not skill. I got lucky. At least we got a nice, easy boss fight. The mom's foot fight is gonna be no joke if I don't find, uh, don't find something. All right, wiener dogs, have a good one, sir. Oh, God. Well, at least that did some damage, I guess. Oh, range up. Let's see. I should have booked that first. What if it's the rock? Can I take that? Wait, I have the... Oh, man. Can I take that without re-rolling since it's in the boss room or no? Zaxius, it's your call, sir. Yes, yeah, since it's a unique drop. That makes sense. Just wanted to clear it with the challenge maker to make sure we were fine. All right, now I'm slow, but I have a chance. Boom, boom, boom. No, I did not do Amps Challenge. I think that was a little hardcore. It had to be a very uh, interesting segment to do. I do want to do Amps Challenge. The Meat Forever Challenge uh, can only shoot at things that Meat Boy can't touch. The very interesting challenge. So you're saying there's a chance. I've got a nice poll for us to do right after this run. Should be a fun one.
I know, where's all my followers, man? Where are they? My cult is very weak right now. Thank you all for having a reasonable discussion. Thank you for having a reasonable discussion. It's been my experience as a broadcaster. MOBA discussion goes sour really quickly. Thank you all for being awesome and not insulting each other like a bunch of dum dums. The Kool Aid isn't nice enough. Not getting what you're selling. See you later, Chazbot. Have a great one, sir. Shoop the whoop. Yes. Give me that. Looks like a bloodthirsty doctor. We haven't found any uh, pills either, surprisingly. I can get items here. Maybe this is my chance to get some followers, huh? Demon Babby. Demon Babby. Speed up, kick ass. 2D Isaac, that's me. Doing great, Mid. Doing great. Was somebody post the run rules for Mr. Mid? How is Demon Babby formed? Good question. Good question. Man, all those single rolls. Yeah, as with most things, um, the the negative portion of a community or whatever it is is usually the ones that yell the loudest, not the majority. They are the vocal minority. I mean, I've re-rolled the crap out of this room. Do I re-roll these again? Because they're technically item rooms now? I think I have to do one more re-roll. As much as I want to pick up that syringe, I think to, in the spirit of the challenge, I should re-roll once more to pick those up. That's a follower. One more roll, please. Nice. Followers for days. Finally, we have a little bit going. I also had the way for this run, so... 
looking pretty good. Most commands are available for everybody. Uh, Gruber's just on a timer that allows him not to spam post it. Yeah, well, at least we got some followers going now. I'm happy about that. Took long enough. I'm glad we re-rolled those, because I could have picked up items that were not followers. They wouldn't have really, really worked. followers yeah it's all good though KQ no worries all right a little low on health now but look at this we actually have stuff no flying no gambling no d6 Ooh, that's nasty cypher smurf but maybe Jeepers Creepers, would you check out his peeper? It's great crap. Whoa, dude. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm honestly tempted. Let's do it. Let's risk this for a biscuit. Temptation sets in. I do have the habit, so it's only a half heart. Hero font, nice. Yeah, half heart because waiver. Spawn on the other side, okay. Unique item can use. The devil. We'll reroll. Oh, shoopy, shoopy, shoopy. I mean... It's been going. I wouldn't say great, but it's been going. Yeah, okay. Give me hearts, please. Please, 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 please. Speed up, okay. So you guys are entering very dangerous territory in the conversation. Please keep it down. Not that you aren't right now. Just saying dangerous, dangerous territory. Dangerous. What do you do? Tears up? Nice. into that boss room. Didn't want to do that. I should probably take one more hit here. I should probably take one more hit here.
Well, it, the very worst, I had to bomb myself in the boss room. So. That's worst case scenario. It still could only be a half uh, heart damage either way. No, you guys are doing just fine. The conversation of MOBAs is going, it's, that's fantastic. I have nothing against what anybody said. I'm just saying you're in dangerous territory because what happens sometimes when we have MOBA conversations is people state things that are not in a way that states your opinion. They try to state facts and that becomes insulting to other people. And then an argument breaks out and then shit goes crazy. But you guys are being just fine. I know uh, the world champion is a big deal. I want you guys to be able to discuss it. Just. Keep it to your own opinion, that's all I ask. Yeah, I did get hit in the boss room. Nice. Get dunk, mama. Roll it. Health up? Sure. Down the rabbit hole we go. Oh, I walked right through that. That was a miracle. So happy I at least got got a couple followers. It's a miracle. Definitely more businesses should do that uh, esports stuff. People will come out to watch that. No worries, Penny. You guys do a great job of uh, discussing things and being nice about it. As with most things, uh, communication is key, and finding a way to word things that state things in your opinion is one of the best life skills you can have, actually. It's not even just a Twitch TV chat thing. It's one of the best life skills you can have, being able to express an opinion, perhaps an opinion that somebody else does not share in a way that is not insulting to them. Gets you a long way in life. We are doing the Cult of Isaac. Have to pick up any followers I find. Must re-roll all items if a re-roll is available in hopes of getting a follower. That includes boss rooms if I have one available. I have the habit, so I have a re-roll available for every item. Damn. Doom. Thank goodness for the wafer. I'm feeling pretty confident now that I have the wafer. Well, it worked out. Whoa, did you see my flies go all wonky there? That was interesting. That was interesting.
Okay, the way Polyquad Shot interacts is you must pick up, um... You want to pick up Quad Shot before Poly. If you pick up Poly, then Quad, it splits your Poly damage into four. If you pick up Quad, then Poly, you get four Polyphema Shots. Oh yeah, I do have to pick up Quest Turbo Quest Master. Sorry, that's actually a really good call. I will pick that up right now. Yeah, I mean, it compares to something like baseball or football. Uh, Esports is incredibly young. Really, Slack? Because that was not... That was not my understanding. Well, Slagahawkus would know better than I, so... There you have it. Heard it here first. Does not matter which order you pick up Polyquad in. Yay, a boss! Yay! Roll out. I agree with that dog runes. Uh, I think there's always going to be a market for esports. Uh, like, yeah, League of Legends is huge right now, but there will be other games that become large, and more games will come along. And yeah, I think esports is always going to be a thing. They'll just expand on the games that are already there, and new games will arrive. Uh, there's esports scenes, large and small. Yes, the largest ones will get the the most um, exposure. That triple soul heart action. Yeah, other games will follow, and the games that do stick around for esports are usually like at least five, six, seven, eight, ten year venture. We're just gonna do lazy envy fight. Lazy envy. Worked out good. Sometimes you get hit there, but <laughs> it's so much easier than trying to dodge everything. For laziness sake. Nice, found the boss. Here we go.
Well, I can't believe that that bomb didn't get pushed away. Mama, please. All right, going down. Okay. Uh, I guess I had to re-roll it. Yeah, sure. What's up, Mr. Horror? How you doing, sir? Honestly, not terribly concerned about anything right now. Just get me to the boss room. Or how do I go about getting emotes removed if I want to like, or if I want to revamp an emote? How do I go about doing that? Come on, horseman. How much health do you have, sir? Game, please. Yeah, just toot on him. It's cool. Oh, God. So quick. If I won the lotto... 400 million, what'd you do? Save it? I mean, yeah, you're gonna buy it. You're gonna buy a house and a car and all that stuff, but, uh... Would not be spending all that much of the money. I'm not- I've never been a proponent on... Buying stuff. I don't like stuff all that much, so... I wouldn't do much with it, to be honest. Buy the nice car, nice house, pay your taxes, retire. Certainly donate some of it, absolutely. I mean that's just that's just more money than you'd ever need. I mean past uh past enough to live comfortably, I think it's really having that much money does not make you happy. It's stuff to stuff definitely doesn't make you happy. I mean, yeah, having that lifetime of financial security would be great, but you'd want to do something good with the money. You wouldn't want to, like, oh, I'm going to go buy a yacht and travel the world and do all this stuff. It's not... It's just stuff. You could do a lot of good with that much money. 
Come on, where's my boss room? Give it to me. I don't like this room at all. Getting anxious. Are you ready, Satan, to get tutored on aggressively? I think he's ready. Let's find out how ready he is. That's true, Kitsune. Like, most millionaires never hit it big or run their own business, stuff like that. Yeah, they do all that stuff, but uh, most people that have million plus dollars have lived like a poor person for most of their life to have that much money. It's not about a get rich quick or anything like that. It's about being financially smart for a long period of time. All right, I'll take it easy. We'll take it easy. Then. We got there. Do do do. G G.